Welcome of UFC Unlimited Fight Channel. Coming up next, it's a UFC featherweight division fight. All right, so here he is, one of the more prolific takedown artists in the UFC at present. And when you get some praise from Daniel Cormier, when it comes to your offensive takedown game, you know you're doing something right. And we talk about wrestlers and judo players and grapplers, but this guy just combines all of that. He is able to use foot switch from the grappling game. He is able to use throws from judo, and he's able to use wrestling in the, from the wrestling game to take people down. He has an array of takedowns at his disposal, and he uses every single one of them from the speed of the level change to the timing to the knowledge of where to go next when the guy starts to bend, he's truly, truly something special. I don't think he could take you down, but tonight he doesn't have to. So he does not in this to. matchup, prevailing wisdom is he'll be able to get this fight to the canvas. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Our tale of the day for this, our main event of the evening. More than a decade separates these two fighters when it comes to the age with similar height and reach. All right, now for the particulars, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 8 inches tall, weighing in at 136 pounds. Fighting out of Lakewood, Colorado, USA, El Tigre. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the right corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Okay, protect yourself at all time, will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your point. Definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success. I want to see how this plays out. Trying to go to the body here, unable to find the target. Straight to his land. Cable inches right there, there boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Nice slip to avoid the left. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this jump. Nice. Lee 
he gets hit by that kick to the midsection. You gotta do better defensively. And both guys really throwing with authority. He's very critical when he throws that body kick. Connects with a right. Man, he's just got a great feel for the striking realm early in this one. The timing is on point. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up. Punch over the top. And they separate. Lee gets absolutely punished by that head. You got to whip this hip into that kick. Oh, beautiful shot there with the hook. I'm not sure his opponent saw that one coming. His opponent is taking a straight punch. He's hooking right around the guard to land and land efficiently. Missed with that attempt. Oh, the straight hand lands flush to the body by Lee. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Checks the leg kick. Oh, big roundhouse attempt just misses. That could have been lights out. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton, and to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. Big power shot there. If this guy doesn't move his head, his night is about to end. Look at the turnover in that kick. Oh, big roundhouse attempt just misses. That was a thudding leg kick. Nice straight punch. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Well, the leg kicks have been a big storyline in this one, and there's another one. So he continues to slow his opponent down, and nice poker face on the other side. I'm not sure how many more he can take. He won't be able to take many more. Think about Edson Barbosa, how he lands those beautiful leg kicks, no wind-up so fast. Eventually, guys get stopped from taking too many. This seems to be the path that he is wanting to take tonight in this fight. Oh, effective strike there by Lee. If you take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Strong hook to the head there by Lee. Superman punch now. Round two is next. All right, well, his kicking game was outstanding in that round. We'll see if his opponent can make the adjustments, but take us through the replays before we get there. It's always weird to watch a young fighter start to come into his own. Early in his career, he did not have this ability. He did not have the ability to dictate and control fights with his legs. Now he does, and he looks like a future champion in the making. This round, you want to keep mixing things up. Use your punches, use your knees, use your kicks. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets underway. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Big ball to punch land. Now he'll get back to range. Give me that inside. Give the leg now. 
just misses with that one. Clipped him with the right hand there. Just unable to quite find that range. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Circling away towards the left now. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Big head kick! Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch landed. Head off the center line, slips the punch. Oh, big left hand there. Oh, looked like he might have been in range, but misses with the kick. Three minutes and change to go in round two. Man, has he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two. Definitely picking up the pace after round one. So we got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Trying to kick the leg out. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Nice punch here. Oh, high amplitude head kick! Oh, big elbow. Well, if you like Muay Thai striking, this might be your moment in this fight as he gets the tie clinch. This is a massive moment for this fighter. He is a great Muay Thai fighter. Look for him to go knee-knee and then try to land a big one to the head. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Good night if that landed. Lee's right torso starting to bruise pretty good here. Well done to block that powerful kick to the body. Lands another shot to the body, beautifully placed as he continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. That's the biggest shot in the fight thus far. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Trying to do damage now with the kick. That's a miss. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Splits the guard, lands the right hand. 20 seconds to go. And he caught the kick, we'll see what he can do with it. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round, really hasn't let up. When it comes to his aggressiveness, certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. And that's the end of round number two. All right, there's the horn indicating the end of the round. So potentially a big factor here, ladies and gentlemen. The cut on the cheek sustained in that round. Certainly better to be below than above the eye, but the cut man's got to get in there and close that thing up.
All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC. And I'd imagine a lot of these replays are going to be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're going to see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Good job keeping that head off the center line. Slips to avoid the right hand. Just out of range with that strike. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Straight right, he misses. And he landed the right hand there. They continue to exchange. Next there, pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. What a beautiful uppercut. It landed beautifully, perfect placement on that shot. Great punch. Just over three minutes to go in round three. Hands high, hands high. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Big kick land. Lee gets tattooed with that hook. He's gonna have to change some things here. Real sneaky body kick. Oh, big punch land. Lee's head kick attempt, that one is blocked. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Lee gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Nice defense there, huge block. Just miss with that right hand. Great punch landed with so much power. Back and forth we go. Huge block there. The oh, nice knee to the body. Just what he needed there. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Nice counter right hook there. Oh, damage done. Bleeding from his cheek now. Went for the inside leg kick. Big punch land. Ooh. Oh, and a 
nice jab by him there, and that's gonna give his opponent some problems if that keeps landing. He's having a tough time getting his offense going because that jab is just stopping him every time. Oh, nice jab. Well, the right hand has been there at times, not that time. Beautiful kick. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. Take a look back at some of the action in that previous round, DC. A lot to like on both sides, really. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did, and they both found success over the course of that round. All right, DC, here we go with our next round. It wasn't just the accuracy, it was the aggressiveness, the volume. It was unbelievable to watch him be so active. The cardio, the push, the pace, and the pressure that he fought with. It's going to be very interesting to see if he can maintain this over 15 minutes. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. That one snuck in. Nice strike. What a body kick. Oh, that's a beautiful kick. Oh, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Ooh, what a punch. Lee gets touched by that kick to the body. Big kick. Oh, nice. Lee's kick attempt there blocked. Back to his patented kicks here, but unable to find the target there. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his corner, but he was going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may flow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got a pressure. He's got to go chase that finish down. Oh, he might be out. Able to check the high kick. Left hand punch from the clinch. And they separate. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Oh, he is off, but man, is he hurt. A finish could come here at any time. Big punch lands through the middle. Just over two minutes to go in the round. Big leg kick land. Good kicks there by Lee. And he caught the kick. And they separate. Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. Oh, nice. While the body was wide open, his opponent took advantage. Kick to the body, lands flush. He's going to have to make some adjustments here moving forward. Nice punch lands over the top. Clip for the right hand. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand just out of range. Under a minute now to go in the round. Look at how he 
turns his hip over when he throws that kick. You don't know when that leg is coming. Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Oh, 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 oh. Gets up again here, but hurt. Thirty seconds remain in the round. Nice punch, Lance. Oh, nice offering there with the knee. He talked to us a lot about that on Thursday. Felt like the knees would be there. It was certainly there on that exchange. He knew they would be available. He just knew he would have to find the right opportunity and right time to land this round. Nice kick. Oh, he continues to attack that bloody cheek. His face is a mess. And there's the buzzer indicating the end of round four. All right, so there's the end of the round. The cut on his lip is only getting worse. We've kept an eye on it tonight. The cut man is gonna have to do some work here to try to prevent that from becoming more of a factor here in this next round. All right, so there's the end of the round. Few things in MMA more devastating than a head kick and nearly produced a knockout for him there. We talked to him earlier in the week and he talked about chances to take the kicks high. He got a chance, he took it, he landed that kick and almost got the fight finished. Let's see if he can go and do that again. All right, next round getting underway Ready? here, and both fighters still look pretty fresh to me. Clearly, DC, they put in the right work when it came to the cardio during training. They both have reputation for vast cardio. You see in the training that they do at their gym that cardio is key, and you watch it in the way that these two fighters perform. looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Nice punch there by Lee. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. It's beautiful leg kick thrown. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Nice one, two there. <laughs> Trying to establish that jab once again. <laughs> Unable to connect there. Real nice body kick. now. Oh, straight right. Big body kick lands. Would you look at the size of that bruise on his body? His opponent will likely continue to attack. Nice loop and punch. Oh, lands another punch there. And not a mean guy. He's just doing the smart thing. Oh, he out. has to be attacking that cut. John, I mean... If he's not, then he's doing his opponent a favor. Attack that cut. Make him beat. He's got the overhand. Now he's working. That's one of those shots. And if you take one of them, if you're in the night, that one will have a rival to Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. He's getting absolutely worked here from the top. Let's see if there's an uptick in his urgency here as he tries to get back up. Switching stances here. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Let's go. Looking to land the right just out of way. Oh! Who's oh. hurt? Serve him up. Go get him. Knee to the body. Whoa! Lees has got full mount now. Now he's on top of him looking for a finish. Well, the ground and pound has been on point tonight. Good work here by Lee. Well, he's up, but oh, is he hurting. 
sneaky head kick. Oh, that's a nice strike. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Oh, a huge block there. Oh, nice. Nice. Right under the elbow. The body just lands. Oh, I love the jab. I know you love the jab. That was a nice one. It's my favorite punch in all the fight. Under one minute remains in round five. Just missed with the leg kick. Not there. Flush with the head kick there, DC. Beautiful setup to get his leg up there quickly before his opponent can react. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Big kick land. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Final 10 seconds of the fight. Watch land. What a fight. All right, let's look back at some of the action. DC, they go the distance tonight, but you got to think he won over the judges with his striking acumen tonight. Yeah, you got to watch one of the best strikers in the entire UFC. He did everything so well, and in my opinion, he should cruise to a very easy decision. The official decision is now in. Here is Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest. 49-46. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon! Nice job by him there as he is your winner via unanimous decision. And sometimes I would think it's easier said than done to just leave the judges out of it. Dominant performance and he gets his hand raised. Yeah, and if you've got to go to the judges, leave no question, right? Be the person that is so dominant that you...